join us today doing probably our craziest experience video yet. It's going to be slightly different to our usual format because it's going to be with a P1 GTR at Goodwood. But first things first, I need to get all suited up, ready to go. Okay, safety. Okay, so we've got a fireproof overalls for you, so the race suit. Okay. Fireproof underwear and top. Okay. Some race boots and some socks. Okay, so everything, amazing. Everything off and that on. And okay. then what we'll do when we go down to the car is I've got a helmet, a hands device, balaclava and gloves for you. Okay, amazing. Perfect. So I'll go put this on. Perfect. So you can just change here, it's fine. <laughs> I'm going to leave all of my stuff here so that you can uh, keep it and I'm going to go get changed. I'll be right back. Okay, I've got in changed. I've got my race overalls on now. We're going to head down to check the car out, check the P1 GTR. These are really comfortable. It's time to see the car. Okay, so it's quite loud here. But we've got the P1 GTR and we're going to give you a full tour of the exterior and interior. This car was a limited run. They only did about 50 of them. And then we're going to get to go up the hill and one, but look, we're going to show you around. They've changed everything around the front. We've got a new front bumper, new canards, whole new design around front for extra aero and more track oriented uh, sort of focus around here. We've got these little buttons, which are quick release buttons, which are all over the car. You'll keep seeing them all over. This particular car, they've actually named Naomi. And when we come around the side, we've got new side skirts as well, completely different to the P1, of which they made about 375 of the road car. We'll show you the inside afterwards. I need to keep my voice up because yeah. it's quite loud. This right here is a quick release for the door. There we go. Right here you've got a double fuel injection right here, which is pretty intense and you just have to fill it up. Up there, it's not a normal fill up spot, but it's pretty cool. So, around the side we've got air vents, we've got more quick release buttons, we've got race tires on this particular car. We're running those wet tires because the track is quite muddy. We've got the lightweight new wheels, We've got the, these sort of really shiny brakes, carbon ceramic, new design for the P1. And the new side skirts are now back. We've got this huge wing. And we'll show you inside, you've got a DRS button which opens the wing up. New exhaust, titanium exhaust, which is absolutely stunning. Here's your air jack to lift the car up. And then a whole new diffuser around the back where you can see everything through to the gearbox. And it's absolutely stunning to look at. Around the side as well. We got everything the same, all the quick releases, a little homage to Bruce McLaren and all of the different years as well as up here, if we open it, you've got the electric engine charging spot. Now this car produces, and also the oil, it produces 986 brake, I believe, which is about 200 from electric engine. But when you press the boost button, which we'll show you inside, you get everything. But anyways, I'm going to go around and hop inside and show you all the details inside. Okay, so it's not easy to get into, but once you're in, you're in a little cocoon. We've got this race seat, which is adjustable. You can move it front and back, as well as adjust the side bolsters right there. We've got this steering wheel, um, which is absolutely insane. You've got your standard McLaren powertrain and handling settings, so you can go normal sport and track. We're gonna run normal and normal uh, for this particular run. We've got the DRS button, which opens the wing, the pit speed regulation button, your rain button, E-mode, charge, launch for a launch control, boost which gives you all of the power, electric and petrol, obviously engine start, neutral, press the torque to talk on your radio and iPass for an extra boost. Your up and down gear shift selectors, we've got a kill switch here, hazards and front windscreen heating, a um, little bit of an information screen, your dash which is like the standard P1, um, which is absolutely awesome. Down here we've got sort of the control for the climate and all of that stuff. Nothing really to see here, there's no radio, everything's been taken out. You've got your door releases, so you pull this for the left door and the right door, and that releases them, and an emergency switch down here. Apart from that, it's pretty bland in here, all carbon fiber. This car costs well over, over a million pounds. Um, there are a few street legal ones. We've also got a fire extinguisher here, and it is just absolutely insane. It sounds crazy, so what we're gonna do now to show you the startup. How does it feel so far? Mate, this is 
beyond incredible. Yeah. This whole well, experience. Oh, we have to move. All right. See ya. All good. Yeah. We're good, yeah. Unbelievable. Thank you so much for that. What a machine. It's cool, isn't it? You can see you don't even get near the capabilities of the car. Oh, yeah, it's just no. tight and twisty, but yeah. Oh mate, that was that was just insane. Yeah, and if you, if you want to pop around. your belts undone, yeah. Normally they're gonna with the guys in the other car they're gonna put a chop behind the wheel and then sorry, can but you can if you want to hop out and have a oh, okay, yeah, 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 yeah. If you yeah, okay, just cool. um so this I just sort of push up. Yeah, just just that to give a bit more yeah, of a there you, there you go. go. Wow. Yeah, we can slip our helmets off and all the guys are up here, so yeah. have a walk around and have a chat. Have a chat, see the other cars. Yeah. Well guys, that's the craziest experience video we've ever done. P1 GTR. We're gonna go back now and I'll keep talking to you talking to you about that. Whilst I'm not being thrown around the car, but wow, that was um mind blowing. We're driving back down the hill now, so I've taken the GoPro off. I'm gonna talk to you about the whole experience because maybe you couldn't hear me earlier, I don't really know. But the way this car handles is unreal. Even just being a passenger, it, was, it felt like it was ripping my face apart around the corners. Like my eyeballs felt like they were gonna fall out the side of my head. The braking is just as incredible. And driving up this track, It's crazy. I mean, look at this cockpit. It's 
pure race car with the digital dash over there. I mean, experiencing this car is something I'll never forget. I've never driven anything which feels more raw and more hardcore than this. It's just literally the most intense race car experience you can get. And, uh, and I mean, the performance with close to a thousand horsepower, as you can imagine, the acceleration is just out of this world. Slightly squeaky brakes now classic race car. So that was the P1 GTR, as I said. People are revving all over, but that was an unbelievable experience with a professional driver in a race car on a racetrack. Goodwood Hill is an absolutely unbelievable place. Thank you so much for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. Please remember to subscribe if you haven't already. Give this video a thumbs up. There'll be loads more of this coming very soon, and I'll see you in the very near future. Cheers. Bye-bye. Hey, Quick cap saying it, Saturday in the mouth. Snow Julia.